Hey everyone, Dashing Dink here. Stick around to the end of the video and see what happens with our AR. Did we climb? Did we lose ground because of another DoorDash app issue? Stay tuned to find out. DoorDash, you ready? Ron, say hi. Well, hello, how are you doing in the morning? <laughs> Bill, say hi. How's it going? This is my W2 guys. All right, the W2. This is Ron, this is Bill. These are the guys I work with. But this is what I do two nights a week. Two nights a week. It's fun with it too. A little more B-roll. <laughs> See you guys. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if you guys caught that. He said, on Dasher. <laughs> All right, good morning everybody on this Sunday, January 28th, I believe. We're getting close. We're almost to the end of the first month of 2024. Excuse me. We just got our first order of the day, $6 to go, I think it was 2.3 miles or something from the South McDonald's. But we're gonna continue this 100% uh, AR challenge today for a little bit, a couple hours. And um, let's get to it. Twenty minutes later. ADA? Yeah. Thank you. Thanks, guys. Have a good day. You too. All right. Thank you, Chris, for your order. I appreciate it very much. Enjoy your McDonald's and have a wonderful day. All right, we just received a uh, double order. It's going to the same person, but we're going to pick up one item from Dollar General, and then we're going to pick up some Dunkin'. And it's for $11.70, I believe. I didn't even look at the miles. How's it going today, man? Okay, how about you? Good. 
Oh, easiest order ever. <laughs> and I do not need the receipt, sir. Have a good one. Thank Appreciate you. Business. Yep, have a good one. All right, fastest Dollar General order I think I've ever had. I think it's 33 seconds from the time I hit shop now to uh, the time we scanned it. So or hit proceed to check out whatever whatever stops the timer and uh, now we're gonna head over to Duncan we'll grab that stuff uh, I think it's four items and get it to the customer good morning how's it going today I'm doing wonderful all right thanks guys appreciate it Thank you. all right everyone we got the duncan in the hot bag cold bag along with the dollar general etc somebody must have a headache but i think we're just heading over to a hotel right down the road here and prepare for squinting eyes because the sun is shining bright today we got blue skies aplenty in the Northland, so. Morning. Thank you, Bethany, for your order. I appreciate it. Enjoy your Duncan and have a wonderful day. Okay, so we got those two dropped off here's one thing that really bugs me about the doordash app so i had to go to dollar general and pick up one item then i had to go to duncan and pick up some items for the same drop off why do i need to take two pictures i think that is the goofiest thing if it's going to the same place they evidently routed it to me so that i was picking up stuff for the same person i should just have to take one picture it just seems like the most asinine, idiotic feature of the DoorDash app. Anyway, now we just got, I believe it was $8.53. It was to go like 12.8 miles, but it's better than $3.10 to go 10 miles. So, um, and that is from Taco John's and we're like three, three and a half miles from Taco John's because we're clear on the south end of town. So it won't be as bad as it looks. We're going to head up to the north end where I like to be anyway, because that's where the mall parking lot is our favorite place to park. Let's head over there now. Morning guys or a guy. <laughs> Guess I only see one of you. <laughs> yeah. I love it when there's no drinks. Yes. <laughs> All right, man, thanks. Thank you so much for your order. I appreciate your business. Enjoy your Taco John's and have a wonderful day.
Okay, we haven't even made it back to town or back into the zone yet, and we received an order from Burger King on the south end of town for $5.50, and the miles it was like four and a half miles or something like that, but like I said, we're not even there. On the app, it looks like the house is just a few blocks away, so let's head on over to Burger King. We'll go get this order. Yeah, for Julie. Thank you. Two orange juices. All right, thanks guys. Have a good day, thank yeah, you. you too. It's supposed to be 44 today. Awesome. Yeah. Might have to lock up. <laughs> there you go. All right, everyone. Um <laughs> I wasn't able to record that because when I got here and pulled in uh, someone was standing outside and I didn't even have time to push the button and it wasn't for that person but it was for somebody that also lives in the house <laughs> and he's like come on in blah 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 I'm like um, I don't know if I should be coming in your house <laughs> so anyway I wish I could have got it on camera uh, we just had another one come in it is $13.31 to go 10 miles from Duncan. So let's head on over to Duncan and grab this 13 bucks. Well, as you guys saw, the order was ready to go, which is awesome. You get really good orders um, and money from Duncan if you don't have long wait times. And I love it, absolutely love it when the order is ready to go. Um, we are heading north on Urban Avenue for, I don't know, quite a ways, um, eight miles. And the customer has given me some instructions I've never kind of dealt with before. It says hand to me, but then it says, please go in side door of garage and put in fridge. It's four drinks, half a dozen donuts, and a breakfast sandwich, like a hot breakfast sandwich. So I'm not sure if they just want the drinks in the fridge I mean obviously I'm going to use some common sense and my best judgment once I get there and assess the situation but I'm assuming they want the drinks in the fridge because it's it's uh, it's not hot coffee or anything it's these uh, flavored refreshers they're called something like that but um, I don't know we'll find out when we get there all right, before I turn the corner here and get squinty-eyed from the sun, uh, she actually met me outside, so I didn't have to do anything with the garage, which is nice. So, all right, guys, we're heading back towards town. I'm still in the zone. We'll see what we get. Okay, guys, I'm about halfway back to the uptown area, and we just received a McDonald's order for $7 going 4.4 miles. Now, 
I'm probably about two miles from McDonald's, so this is going to be a breeze. How's it going? What's going on? We see each other again? Yeah. <laughs> I don't have two phones this time. I got a GoPro, so. Oh, nice. <laughs> been busy this morning? Yeah. Yeah, really busy, actually. <laughs> but I'm doing a challenge right now where I'm taking every order to 100% AR. Oh. That's stressful. There's so many like two dollar orders. <laughs> oh yeah. Ten miles. Oh yeah. I had a few of those yesterday. Yeah, I got. Well, I had I had three this morning in a row that, that was two dollar orders, and they're all more than seven miles away. And I was like, no. Oh, you did my acceptance rate. You declined it because I didn't get them. I didn't get those, so they must have jumped to somebody yeah, I must else. Have jumped somebody else. I, or I was know. in the middle of a different one. Yeah. Know, so. I, take it, right? I just can't. Like, <laughs> like I'm gonna lose money because of damn. Yeah, like, all right, man. Be safe out there. Yeah, you too. Good luck. Check me out, dashing dink. <laughs> How you doing today? I'm doing. Thanks fine for your too. service, man. Appreciate it. Thanks for two hundred bucks. All right, man. Have a good one. Appreciate it. Thanks. How much do we need at the DoorDash? Yep. All right, I'll just bring it on house. No problem, bud. No problem. All right, both these bags are. One has the drink, one has the food, right? All right. No problem. Thank you, man. I appreciate yeah. it. Yep. All right. Thank you so much for your order. Enjoy your McDonald's and have a wonderful day. Right. we just dropped off the McDonald's order for Kristen and I immediately backing out of the driveway got a Walgreens order it's for two dollars and twenty cents it's two items but it is a like it's just a direct pickup um, Let's see, it says go into the store to the photo counter, tell an employee you are picking up a completed, oh, come on. Tell, tell employee you are picking up a completed pickup order scheduled for delivery, not a photo order. So I'm not sure what this is. But we're gonna go get it, we're gonna check it out. I'll bring my red card just in case, but it doesn't say I'm gonna need it, so. All right, here we go to Walgreens for $2.20. It's only going two miles too, so at least it's not 12. It didn't tell me to bring my red card, so I'm no, assuming it's paid for. Yeah, we just have to scan it out. All right, so. sounds good. I don't think I've done one of these yet. <laughs> All right, thank you so much. Careful, this one's kind of heavy. Okay, I appreciate it. well we obviously we got it picked up that was pretty simple didn't have to shop didn't have to pay didn't have to do nothing but grab a couple bags and we're just heading down here uh, I think it's some apartments down off of uh, 30th Street so it says contactless delivery please contact the customer to set up um, drop-off instructions so 
must be a new person to the app or something like that. I mean, it didn't say new customer as far as DoorDash, but I've seen that a couple of times before. So we'll go down here, we'll give her a quick call and see what she wants me to do. Hi, is this Linda? Oh, okay. I'm trying to figure out how to get in. All right, I'll. Uh... Okay. Thank you. Yep. Bye bye. Okay, that's someone in the cities. Uh, let's try this. Call has been forwarded to an automatic voice message. <laughs> of course it has. is not available. Please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up or press 1 for more options. Linda, there are some bags out here by the door for you. Thank you. If you are satisfied with your message, press 1. Listen to your message. Press 2 to erase and re-record. Press 3 to continue recording where you left off. Press 4. Order is by the inside door. Thank you and have a wonderful day. Okay, everyone, that's gonna do it for me today. Um, it's a little after 10, I have church at 11, so I'm gonna go grab some coffee, head home, get ready. And uh, I'm not sure yet, we'll see what takes place. Um, I'll either be back out this afternoon or tomorrow but most likely tomorrow I do have some VA clinic appointments tomorrow so I'll probably be doing the lunch shift tomorrow but either way we'll have content um, like I said yesterday I'm gonna try to do like maybe a breakfast video and a lunch video to try and bank some videos so that I can still release a video every day even when I have appointments and things come up. So I wanna thank you guys for riding along with me today. That last one was a little different. Somebody from the cities ordered for the person up here. I tried their apartment number, couldn't get a hold of them. It went to a voicemail automatically. Um, the lady on the phone who ordered the stuff said, just leave it for my cousin at the main door. So I took a picture of it, did what I was told. So. Hopefully, nothing happens. I want to thank you guys for riding along. I want to thank you for subscribing, liking, sharing, commenting on the videos. And I hope you guys have enjoyed your weekend. It's supposed to be 44 degrees here today in Bemidji, Minnesota. That is unheard of in January. <laughs> um, it was nice yesterday. Things were melting. But today, the sun is shining. The wind is really, really low. So it is going to be just a phenomenal day. Um, I expect to see a lot of people out walking and having a good time. So, but yeah, I enjoyed the day. We did, go, oh, um, we did like $54 and some change in two hours and 20 some minutes. So not too bad of a morning. Um, and then our acceptance rating went from, I believe it was 93% when we started the day and we are at 96% now. So we actually gained a lot of ground on this Sunday morning. 
which is amazing. So we're steadily climbing, we're getting our way there, we've got 4% to go, and we know it's gonna take a little bit of time to get the last percentage because <laughs> of a DoorDash app issue, but we did good today. So I'm, I'm still positive about doing this challenge. Uh, that last order, all it gave me was $2.20, so. <laughs> but I kind of expected it if it was ordered from somebody in the cities going to their cousin. Well, I'll try not to make this any more long-winded than what it is. You guys have an excellent day. We'll talk to you very soon. And once again, this is Dashing Dink saying, until the next dash.